Hey guys, it's Celine, and today I am going to do some staking of my tomato plants and trimming off some of the sucker branches so that they grow up really big and tall, hopefully six, eight feet tall, instead of spreading out over my tiny little garden. So um, let's get to it. Okay, so here we are with my tomato plants. This is a Mr. Stripey heirloom tomato. And he's got a couple of little sucker branches that I'm just going to reach down inside there and get rid of one. And then I'm going to snip this one. And I'm going to snip this little guy as well. Just because I want lots of stalk to be able to um, grow up off the ground. My intention is that the stalk be about right here and then the leaves above that so that I can plant other things down here and use this space. A couple of trees there. Get rid of some of this. Okay, so here we go. I am going to simply just loosely take some of this uh, tape. I don't even know what it's called, but I know it's garden tape. And I'm going to loosely wrap it around here, maybe. And see what we got. Never used this before, guys. I'm not sure how the dang stuff sticks. That's not it. So I'm going to tie it until I figure it out. Ah, it's sticking. It's not sticking. So maybe I didn't get the right stuff. But this will work. It's nice and soft and pliable. And it's going to keep that growing up, this stalk. Let's see what I did wrong with this tape. I thought it was supposed to stick to itself. But it's not. See? It's not sticking to itself at all. That's okay. I can tie just as well as I can stick. Okay, so this is another one here. There's got a couple little suckers way down in here. I put these plastic containers around the base of my, my tomato plants in hopes that the hookworms wouldn't climb up it to get to my tomatoes. I've heard that that works. So we'll see. I'm going to take this guy off. He's not necessary. And to be honest, I should have taken this guy off, but I think I'm, I'm at a point now where I need to leave it alone. So I'm just going to tie him. Right there. Okay. There we go on that one. I'm happy with that. Okay, now let me show you. Um, let me move you. So really, guys, that's all there is to it. There's, it's not that hard. You want to make sure that you're not cutting um, the sucker branches or the extra branches off that are the main stalk. You want to make sure that one main stalk keeps going up and that you're only doing the ones that are coming off of it. If you ever have a question and you're not sure that uh, which one is which, you've let it go too long, don't cut any of it because once you top it, if you cut the main one, uh, you cut the wrong one, you cut the main one, however tall that plant is at the moment you cut that, it will never get any taller. So if, in if you have any doubt whatsoever, leave it alone. So let me show you these sucker branches that I cut off. This one, I'm just going to take a few of these off here. And then I am going to put this in a pot, stick it down deep, like this deep where my thumbs are, my fingers, and um, leave it for a week or 10 days, maybe two weeks, and it will, um, It'll, it'll root. These little hairy things along this thing, those are wannabe 
roots. So the deeper you stick them, um, these suckers will root almost every time. So that's it. It's real simple, guys. And I've got 12, 13 more tomato plants to go. So I guess I better get off here and get busy. Talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Be sure and subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed it. If you got anything out of it. I love you guys. God bless. Mwah.